morning, it's great to have Nick from the Community DAO of Harmony talking to us. Um, can you tell us about the Community DAO a little bit? Yeah, so the Community DAO is actually an initiative by Army along with many other DAOs mm -hmm. um, that are going to be formed. Um, currently, there are seven governors. Um, mm -hmm. I am one. Mm -hmm. uh, we are, the governors basically are just running a multi-sig wallet mm -hmm. to help fund grants within the community mm -hmm. uh, to drive adoption of Harmony, yeah. community-driven products. And, you know, it's all about community. Yeah. Um, so the community, it doesn't just have to be the governors. Mm -hmm. You know, the community can get involved at any time. We want to hear feedback. We want to hear suggestions. You know, in essence, it allows voting power to the community. Yeah. You know, the governors, we're not the all-powerful. Mm -hmm. We're there to make sure that the community's voice is heard. Mm -hmm. So if initiatives are brought, mm -hmm. they're going to be better. We bring that to the community for a vote. Yeah. We do the media. We get that voice out. Mm -hmm. And then we execute based on the community's voice. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, that's what a lot of the DAOs are going to do. And I know you guys are building out quite a bit. Yeah. So you already have the validator DAO established mm -hmm. and many more to come. Just yeah. announced the developer DAO, which is really exciting. Yeah, so, absolutely. Yeah. But it's truly just to allow an organization to be flat mm -hmm. and allow the community to have their voice heard. Exactly. So yeah. it's exciting. I think so. <laughs> It's really amazing that uh, you have been our early community, if not even supporting how many with the investments so early on, but now really driving many of the community initiatives. In particular, you being really part of the community already, now representing the community to drive this uh, DAO forward, right? I think Absolutely. you said, yeah, I think you said it right that uh, there are so many voices and initiatives that community can be self driven. But most of all, just super excited that you can come to Denver to meet the team, but also hang out with so many different Ethereum and other projects that are driving the DAO. Um, can you tell uh, us what you think the DAO structure is so different now from what you learned uh, just uh, throughout the years? DAOs kind of just reinvent how an organization operates. Mm -hmm. And, you know, there's many different ways of governance models. And that's actually something that, you know, it's very early on right now for mm -hmm. us. Yeah. You know, we don't know all the governance models. We're working on the government's documents, which, you know, obviously will be available for everyone to read mm -hmm. and review and, and suggestions and feedback. Mm -hmm. It just truly makes an organization flat, like I said. Mm -hmm. You know, mm -hmm. um, it's a whole new vision on running anything. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So. It's exciting to be here in Denver yeah. and learn about all the different DAOs mm -hmm. and see what we can take back to the community mm -hmm. and help further DAOs grow mm -hmm. their initiative yeah. and whatever knowledge that we can learn here. Yeah, so, wow, well, you great. really have the right mentality about community, but also the governance structure. Um, can you tell us how you personally got into Harmony and now this community DAO? Honestly, uh, like many, mm -hmm. I started in crypto mainly as an investor. Um, cool. Harmony was a project I'd read about. Mm -hmm. I thought it was a great alternative to high gas fees because mm -hmm. I, I like to do a lot of speculative trading back in the day. Cool. And then I realized what the community and how involved the community was on Harmony. Mm -hmm. And it really drew me in. Mm -hmm. um, actually, Rock the Blockchain, he's one of the validators, was yeah. one of the first to Daniel, help huh? me get in, Daniel. Yeah. And so started off on the subreddit. Mm -hmm. I learned a lot more about Harmony, saw how engaged the community was yeah. and how active even the moderators were. Worked my way over to Telegram mm -hmm. and now I'm pretty much on every social media platform, Discord. Yeah. And it's just amazing how the community interacts with each other, um, mm -hmm. how they support each other. And yeah. honestly, I'll be in Harmony for the rest of my life. Wow. So. <laughs> really gave us energy this morning yeah. to, say, to hear that. Most of all, uh, like it's really amazing that now you are full-time in this, but also Almost that like you come for the tech and stay for the community, yep, right? Exactly. I didn't expect this, but you said it for the rest of your life. And it's true. It's not just about like harmony the platform, right? Now that you are part of a DAO, you'll be driving so many initiatives. Maybe you can tell us what are the uh, big initiatives that you think that maybe even in a year that you hope that uh, many of us will keep driving towards. Well, I think one initiative that I personally would like, and this is not the view of everyone else per se, but yeah. Driving education. Mm -hmm. um, I think that's one important initiative that the, the community DAO can do. Mm -hmm. I'm educating them not only just within blockchain, but mm -hmm. the, the goals of Harmony, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. how it can change, you know, just even onboarding new users exactly. into the community and, and making sure they're safe, they understand how to use wallets, just mm -hmm. being a part of that. I think that's one initiative that can be driven. Mm -hmm. um, you know, a roadmap for that, I'm not sure yet. Mm -hmm, but mm -hmm. I think that's an initiative that I feel 
strongly about. I love it. Uh, sometimes, uh, of course, it's the consensus of the community and then the, the driving power of the governors. But then having a personal mission, you always wake up getting excited that yeah, we are absolutely. working towards that every day. On the wallet part, what would be your wish and how you think uh, we can really impact uh, lives of millions? Well, I think you guys are already working on that with one wallet mm -hmm. coming up. Yeah. Um, so that's exciting. Mm -hmm. I think security is a big thing for people. Absolutely. And, you know, all across the crypto space being that unregulated, mm -hmm. it's not always the safest. Mm -hmm. So driving that, I mm -hmm. think, is probably the, the best. And I think that you guys are on track with Google Authenticator, yeah. things like that. I think that's going to change for the better. Yeah, I love it. And now you finally got into this full time. How does it feel? Like, uh, not just about like really thinking about how the project are doing, now you're actually building, you're actually driving the community towards something. It's the whole full-time thing makes you like, makes your life and like in a different Exciting. perspective. <laughs> Exciting, it's exhilarating yeah. actually, you know. Um, yeah. Being able to put all my passion into it now and dedicate myself full-time, um, it's awesome. Very cool. What else do you want to learn about uh, at Denver this time, uh, talking to DAO people? Well, there's some really good talks this afternoon, so I'm yep. looking forward to some of the DAO talks. Very cool. So we'll see. I want to see how they've organized themselves. Exactly. And like I said, bring that back. What was the best practices? Mm -hmm. Did they have issues? Yep. What did they learn? How did they fix it? Talk with as many of those DAOs as we can, you know? Exactly. And then help that grow for the decentralized future of Harmony. Yeah. These DAOs are going to be the future. Well, some of the after parties too. <laughs> well, the after parties have been Because uh, sometimes it's really about just seeing each other, uh, having a side chat. Uh, it's not about the music or anything, but just being there, showing up. Sometimes really run into like side conversations that uh, I really didn't expect. Well, that's what's great about the crypto yeah. community as a whole, yeah. the whole ecosystem, so. you know, and build bridges, right? Yep. Yeah, I love that. Well, you really understand the ethos and you really understand. Lastly, how do you think Harmony, the platform, if not the some of the core team initiative can help like the community DAO? What else should the team keep hearing and listening so that uh, can really represent um, you guys? I would us? say just continue listening to the community. Yeah. You know, keep an ear down. Yeah. Um, the community is very passionate about this product. We see that. I mean, mm -hmm. we just passed, what, 30,000 on Reddit? Yeah. Yeah. So, and it's growing exponentially. Our wallets have increased. Yeah. So just keep listening and engaging the community. I think that's what the core team yeah. can continue doing. Thank you, will be. And the fact that you can really come and travel and see like the the DAO people here, but also meeting some of the folks at the like Harmony, Harmony core team, is a great start. Uh, Sometimes it's really having a beer together that start a conversation. Yeah, it's yeah. been great. Well, thank you again, Nick, today. Yeah. Yeah.